What's good, Carla Crew? Today we are doing a day in the life. I have a lot going on. I'm going to the gym, meeting with my friend Andy, running a little bit behind because I'm also running a Poshmark business. You're gonna wanna shop on my Poshmark. We're gonna pack it together. Look, y'all. When you run in the business, you everything is the business. This is the life of a, of a posher. Okay. I'll see y'all in my car. That step is like broken. The mailman literally slams his feet down every time he walks up the steps. Like, dude, you're a nice guy, but you're breaking our stairs. Okay, you're breaking our stairs, dude. You see, my mom always tells me not to have road rage, but I don't have road rage. I have road confidence. You are not about to drive slow because I'm blasting my banging music and my bangers. So you will get cut off. I don't know what to tell you, but we're walking into the gym now. They probably like, what the heck she got this camera for? I'm a YouTuber, I'm putting this gym on, and no, it will not get promoted. Thank you. All right, you guys, so I'm walking into the gym now, meeting up with my friend Andy. As you guys can tell, she was already on the treadmill. I thought it was really funny that I'm filming in the gym, but follow her on IG, y'all. That's me dancing, cause I'm about to get to this good old workout. So we started on the treadmill today. I couldn't film much on the treadmill because it was hard to record, so I decided to film Andy, but she's getting to a run. She normally starts with a mile or two for some cardio and a warm up. I was just doing lunges on a slower um, pace, and I climbed through the treadmill thinking it would work, you guys. I literally tried to place this camera everywhere to get <laughs> a good image for you guys, but it was not working, but I was on the treadmill. So we got off the treadmill, you guys. So we're figuring out the next thing we're gonna do. We take it one step at a time. So we're talking about what we're about to do. We're in the room now talking about some business moves because you know, we are ladies who are bosses in the future. So when we're done plotting on what we about to do for the future, we about to lay down our mats and get to this workout. So. I laid down the mat. We did start out with doing some jump ropes. Here we're having a conversation. Who knows what we're talking about? But we are doing jump ropes. It's always fun to work out with your friend. My jump rope was a little bit messed up, but I love to work out with a friend. It's so much more motivational. But I'm just hitting that jump rope, you guys. We're just doing jump ropes. And I decided to make this video a voiceover because, and then I did a model walk. That's so funny. I was like, there's a mirror. I'm about to walk like a model and I'm back to jump roping. But I had to do voiceover because there's really like loud music that plays in the background. And you guys know I don't got no time for that copyright and having my videos blocked and you guys can't see them or whatever goes on with that. But here we are in the little room where you can have a little bit of space to do body workouts. So. Yeah, jump roping is really good to work out your entire body. I was having some fun with it and I just didn't stop jump roping. So straight from the treadmill, we went to the jump ropes and we did the jump roping for about 15 minutes. So like treadmill about 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes, jump rope about 15 minutes. So then there could be like an hour to 15 minute gym session. We were there for about an hour and a half today. But I had fun with the jump rope. I love jump roping and it literally works out your legs, your arms, your whole body. So it's really good to do jump ropes, even at your house, if you guys don't want to go to the gym and it's super easy to do lunges and stuff. So if you do want an at-home workout routine, holla at your girl because I got you guys on that. Then I try to work out my abs with this like roller ab machine. But you guys, you have to be so strong. It is so hard. I just dropped to the floor. <laughs> Do not laugh at me in the comments. I'm muscular. Andy was doing some squats on the side. You guys see there. And yeah, that was about a wrap for inside the room. Then Andy grabbed the camera and said, you guys get your teeth right, period. She said, work out, get your teeth right, period. <laughs> so hitting squats, we decided to go on to the squat machine. I'm trying to sit over here and take a thumbnail while Andy's doing the squats. But on each side, we had 25. So the bar alone is like 10, 15 pounds. And then there was 25 on each side. Obviously, you can do whatever weight that you want. But we go up to like 45 on each side. No, there was 20 on each side. So yeah, it was a nice amount. Then Andy is recording me while I'm hitting my squats. 
You guys got to get that booty popping, that booty right. It's always good to have that bigger booty right. <laughs> so hit those squats and do your thing. All right, so then I'm just like dancing in the mirror because there's mirrors everywhere. Okay, mirrors everywhere. And then Andy went back to hit the squats. So we're doing different reps. So we'll do like three sets of 10 each when it comes to that machine. But you can do 10 to 15 sets. Oh no, 10 to 15 reps and like three sets. So yeah, but our booties is popping. We get into the big booties all year, all fall, all winter, and into the summer. So you guys can subscribe for more workout videos. Let me know in the comments how you guys like these videos. Any requests and I will get those videos done for you ASAP. ASAP. So then I went back on the squat machine, hit my squats, getting it from a different angle here. But you guys see our bodies is together. We've been working out together since like for about three, four years. So me and Andy are both really fit. We both work out on our free times when we don't work out together too. But it's best friend's goals to work out with your best friend. So now Andy's squatting with a 25 and I'm just hitting lunges, alternating. Then there's just like creeps, well, a gym creep in there. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, why? Because he literally is just not even comfortable when you're in the gym. But I feel like every gym has that one guy who makes people uncomfortable. But then I decided to hit the squats that you saw Andy hit just a bit ago. Again, we are holding 25 pounds, squat in, squeeze them cheeks in when you go up. And like I said, we'll do about 10 to 15 of those and we'll hit that three times. And when you do this, you just keep staying active. You keep on persisting through. Don't be taking breaks in between your workout. You will definitely see results like you see on us. Okay, so you can see that Andy and I both are in the gym working out. All right. So here's Andy now. She had to tie her shoelace really quickly. And she is about to hit some more presses. So Andy is really, really strong. And she has really nice leg muscles. So she's doing two 45s on each side. I decided to skip that and we're doing some abs. I hit it about 10 times, but now I'm hitting abs at about 50 pounds. I'm pretty sure it's on. And it is crunches. So Andy's on a different machine and that works out your bum. But I like to do some abs and we're going to hit more abs later on in this video. But as you guys can tell, my face is hurting. I'm in some pain with this one, but it is worth it. Crunches are really good for defining your abs and your core. So I hit that again. Same thing, like I said, 15, time, 15 times, but did that three times. Okay, so it's really like 45. Andy's hitting the machine. We're both just on our grind here. We work out throughout the entire year to maintain, you know, having a nice body for the whole year. And it's really nice to work out with a friend because it keeps you motivated to stay on track if you're not as motivated. So then I hit the same machine that Andy was on. And I'm just laughing because it's just like, like the person I mentioned in the gym earlier. I'm not going to talk bad about him, but he does make everybody in the gym uncomfortable. And everyone could fend for that. But it's okay though. We're just getting some workout. I'm talking to Andy, trying not to laugh. But I did laugh. I'm not going to tell you guys why. I'm not going to roast the dude. He's just a little uncomfortable, okay? And says some inappropriate things that we don't like. Anyways, we're going to lift up our leg. And we're hitting this, like, leg rise over down. So up over down. It's really good for, obviously, your legs, your butt. And you can start to feel that burn. Even if you do this at home, like, 100 times. We just hit it probably, like, about 50 times on each side. But we're laughing because it's like in sync. Like, is this a class instruction? I think it's so hilarious. So we're just basically cracking up laughing at that. <laughs> Goals for best friends. Period. 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 <laughs> yeah, so then we're hitting some abs. We're doing this circuit. So we're doing some like crunches up to touch our knees to start. And then we lift our legs all the way up and we're reaching towards our toes. And don't stop doing this circuit. And we did this circuit three times. So we hit each one about 20 times. It really hurts. You guys see it in my face. So then we reach in towards the knees. Legs out in towards the knees. Andy demonstrated this one. And it works really well. Then you lift your legs up. And that's also going to work out your abs. All right, y'all. So 
that wraps up that portion and then obviously we always leave with some hand sanitizer keep them hands clean okay you guys so we're walking out of the gym now here's andy you guys can follow her on ig all right you're gonna see her in a lot more videos it is time to it's ship so off sunny. my poshmark package yes. you have any last no thoughts I'm just on this really workout sweaty right now we killed it all right so. we have to all shower yeah all right y'all and i can't even see the sun is like right me either literally <laughs> At the post office, about to get this bread. You know this Poshmark bread? So, yeah, you guys, you can shop my Poshmark. I will link it below. This is the process of my life. You'll get a package from me directly to the car lifter. I think that's major. You know, we got to deliver this at the post office. You're going to want to shop on that Poshmark. It's lit. YouTuber life is lit. So, this is the life. You walk into the post office, right, and then you just deliver it. Mail it. Step three, you mail it. You pack it. You get the order. Hey. 